guess what we're about to do. It's been a long time coming. Hey everyone, it's Maury. I am in the Rialta. We are all loaded and ready to go. I'm gonna head up north toward Flagstaff-ish. I haven't quite decided where I'm gonna end up, but I'll figure that out on the way. But everything is ship shape and I'm literally leaving right now. See you on the road. So in my haste to leave, I drove off with the trunk open. I had to pull over and close it up real quick. So now I'm back on the road. All right, I made it to Flagstaff and I mean, I've made it to an undisclosed location and uh, I stopped to grab some blueberries and figure out where I'm headed. I've got a few hours of daylight left still, so I need to figure out um, where I'm gonna stay and if I'm gonna drive any more to get there or if I'm just gonna find a place near this undisclosed location um, to stay the night. And then I will have something to eat and try to plan out what I'm gonna do tomorrow. I still haven't decided exactly what my route is going to be. I'm kind of doing this seat of my pants style. I thought about going through Lake Tahoe. I thought about going through Reno. I thought about going through Utah for that matter. Um, but I know that north of here, it's still pretty cold at night and I don't wanna exhaust all of my propane staying warm for one or two nights. So, um, yeah, I don't know yet, but I'll figure that out later. That's not something that I'm too worried about right now. All right, I've done a little more mapping and um, checking the weather, and north of here isn't as cold as it has been. So I think that I'm going to stay uh, around here tonight and then head up to the northern border of Arizona to Page, and then probably from there head up through Salt Lake City through Boise and then over to Washington. I think that's probably the route that I'm gonna take. All places that I haven't been, um, I actually haven't ever been further north than Flagstaff in Arizona and I've lived here for, gosh, 35 years or whatever. So I think that's the plan. Um, I'm going to get things situated here and, oh, you know, I can show you. I actually get to use my stuff now that I'm out in the van. Uh, I'm going to put my blinds down and we'll see how they work out real quick. So you can see we have a significant amount of light coming through, which also means a significant amount of heat. And this is the door. So I've got my privacy shades. These are blackouts that I installed. And they're, they have magnets on the bottom to hold them in place. I'll drop that one down in a little while. And then I've got my curtain here that I will draw later, but for now it's, you know, like that. So not a bad space. I still need to figure out what to do about this. I mean, I, I guess it's all right. Um, I mean, somebody would have to be at a really strange angle right up against the van to see in through that opening. Um, yeah, I don't know, I'll have to figure that out. Maybe I'll look at it from the outside tonight. But yeah, so this will be, I think, a good spot to get things organized and ready for tomorrow. So with that, I'm going to get myself situated. All right, so I moved. I was staying at Cracker Barrel in Flagstaff, which, I mean, it's very kind of them to have spaces for people to stay the night, but um, it was extremely noisy. So I decided I'm just gonna look for something better. It's loud, um, who knows how long this is gonna go on, and uh, found a nice place not too far from there at all, actually. Um, well, here, I'll, I'll turn the camera around and I'll show you. 
I'm not outside because it's extremely windy, so you wouldn't be able to hear me, but this is my view. I backed into my space. There are a few other rigs out here, but um, nobody close by. And this is where I'm going to stay tonight. Um, it's easily accessible. And um, other than the wind, it's quiet. So here we are. And then tomorrow we're going to continue on north. Um, I don't know if you can hear that wind, but boy, it's strong. I'm in between a bunch of very large trees. I should probably check them out and make sure that they are not going to drop a branch on me. Hmm. So anyway, um, now we are settled for the night. Well, I'm here. I'm parked anyway. I'm not settled yet, but I'm um, going to get settled and I will see you tomorrow. Bye now.